Hello there guys and girls, this is the Prince Prince, when are you for Let's Play episodes of Asphalia? So let's continue on and see what we can do here. As we are expanding our borders. I'm gonna get these units out of here. Hang on, I gotta lower my army maintenance slightly. Fact is, fact is I'm taking a lot of uh, attrition here because it's a pretty terrible province for me, for me to be in doesn't have that much supply limit, which is why I must change that. Should I build this? Eh, let's build an Admiralty because we can. When we get more money, should be okay, I guess. We can make a lot of leaders too, if we wish. Uh, let's go for prestige and tickets because, well, I can gain all the prestige. Don't really need money right now. I have too much of it, so to speak. Although you can never have too much. But oh well. Oh well. So my units, as you can see, I've got quite a lot of uh, infantry and uh, artillery, mostly, as they're pretty good in the late game. I still have a lot of admin power, which I can't seem to be able to use too effectively. I must must get another idea group, I think, to fix fix that. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna try and build another Admiralty when I can, but I cannot build it anyway. That's the problem. Oh, I can. Never mind. Of course, it has to be a coastal province. Then much. Should we build it somewhere? Hmm. Well, of course we should, but where? No, probably I want this before I build the march. Before then, I probably want some temples to be made because of this insane admin power that I have. So let's see if I can build some more temples. Temples, temples, temples. Some here, some constables. Oh, more temples to be built? Where exactly though? I cannot find them. Probably somewhere. I don't know where actually. So some courthouses. No training fields. No, something that costs uh, still uh, admin power. Okay, constables. Yeah, okay, build them there. How about some temples? Cannot build them anywhere, it seems. Like some random territory we can build it in. That would be pretty funny if we did. More constables. So, oh, there we are. Oh, here we can. Oh, I found that small little province. <laughs> of course, we could build it there, I guess. So, let us see what else we can build. Or where else we can build it, rather. Counting house. Oh, yeah, this costs... Uh, it's gonna be actually great, so let's build it. We have something to spend our power on, yay. And some more counting houses. Probably should drop my speed slightly and still get all of these going. And treasury, that would be nice too, to get eventually, but I mean, all this income that we're getting is pretty insane, and I mean, there's not much else I can do. <laughs> Increase it. The thing is, I guess I can max this out. Then I won't have as big of an income, but it's still majestic. Yeah, majestic. That's what I'm gonna call it. That's how I'm gonna call it. And I can now get this, but I can probably wait a little bit. I don't need to get it right now. Hmm. In the meantime, let's get more workshops, shall we? Uh, mercantilist faction. Yes, that's good. Always good. Oh no, we lost him, but this guy looks pretty amazing, if you ask me. Now, trade depots. Canals, no, I need workshops. Okay, speed five. Let's go speed five. And now let's just wait. Get myself somewhere here so that time moves by faster. That's what we want to do. As we're waiting. So right now, what I want to do is, let's see, well, I do want to get more treasuries going, right? And that's going to be important. This cost us a lot of money, but at the end of the day, we're going to be able to get a ton of money as well out of it eventually. This is why I am getting it. Of course, 
I cannot do this. Uh, some workshops. Oh, I can build a few more, it seems. Yes. Oh, more manpower. Although, it's not really necessary, but alright. Thanks for the extra manpower. Uh, workshops. I can build one up there. More counting houses. Oh, that's great. And Switzerland leaves the coalition. Recall the diplomat. Uh, counting houses. Oh, and we're out of money. Great, but we'll gain money back up so fast that it's not even going to miss it. The fact that we were out of money. <laughs> so now, can I actually improve my relations with these guys? Oh, I'm already doing that. Oh, how good of me. Can improve my relations with Castile, though. That would be nice. That would be really nice, actually. Okay, recall my diplomat. Now, England, they're Protestant like me, so... I guess. My maintenance is maxed, which is not good. I, I'm going to lower it. So just so I can get more money, I suppose. Oh, and this one. Let's see, what is this? Let's give naval force limits. I don't care too much about that. To be honest, I can get this here. And I can probably... Oh, they must be right. No, lose some prestige. It's okay. Counting houses. Yeah, let's, let's go for it. Because we can. We have extra merchants. No. Oh, we do have a one that's free. So we're actually in Vienna, right? Oh, we don't. We aren't doing anything here. So let's just collect from trade. Actually, if you look at the trade map mode, I mean, we can uh, steer it to Venice, Frankfurt, or Lübeck. Frankfurt. Yes, Frankfurt. Frankfurt. Wait, Lübeck. We don't own Lübeck, though. Let's just go to Frankfurt, then. Oh, we should own Lübeck, though, so we can send everything there. Recall the merchant, and then transfer trade power, put him here, and then... Please, towards Frankfurt. Yes! Good job. Oh, of course, I can probably get this. <laughs> trade efficiency. Oh, that's great. So trade is always good and more prestige yay now we're maxed on prestige it's amazing really 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 amazing let's see what else fortification effort ah i don't want to lose prestige and just it's just a few ducats though that being said i don't have that many ducats myself right now so yeah <laughs> should have gone for inno innovative though ideas because they're pretty good but I guess can become defender of the faith. Not too helpful because of the technology cost. Yeah, I don't like that. And then royal marriage with these guys. Dynastic. They would not accept. However, the Ottomans. That would be funny because not the same religious group. How? Oh. Russians. That's a good one to go for. Lithuania. Of course, I have no diplomats to go for. Let's do it with Lithuania because we can. And we're gaining so much money that it's funny. And then our military power. Wow, look at our military power. Everything is going up so quickly because we have all these awesome advisors and stuff. Now, Royal Mortar. Let's go for that then. Let's go for a march because we can build it. So now that I think about it, yeah, I'm going to expand northwards. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build here in Lienz. Mm, rather, let's build one here. Yeah, that's fine. It's all good, really. So next, I'm gonna go build some workshops because I can once again. Improve relations with Castile. Impossible to do that anymore. Oh no, Platinate. Okay, that that's actually good. Platinate starting to like me. Improved relations are pretty high, but they still hate me because of aggressive expansion in the next vessel. And they're gonna hate me for a while because of it, I think. Uh, I still don't have the advisor that I want, though. Unfortunately. Really would like him, though. Let's see, new tariff. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. Now, let's see. Can I build more stuff? So how about some extra treasuries or counting houses? Yeah, counting houses. Build lots of counting houses. <laughs> and new technology, which one would it be? Oh, military again. Oh, 
Huh. All right, as you wish then. Should have some claims though on Danzig, but that's all right. I don't want to declare war on them because that would be a lot of allies we'd be facing. Of course though, probably what I want to do, no, not real marriage. <laughs> they would become my vassal, but problem is they don't like me too much. They don't like me too much at all, so. I would just have to do it through war, I guess. Vassalize them. For Saxony, then. And then, uh, what else do I need? I'm gonna need Postum and Brandenburg. So, Brandenburg. Oh, they have big allies. So, yes. Neumark and Potsdam. Let's go Potsdam, yes. Then Neumark. Yeah, that, that seems okay for me. Of course, as usual, let's hire one of these guys. He's not too bright though in terms of uh, how good he is, but I guess we can manage. I'm gonna wait till this is no longer ahead of time and then we can take some awesome uh, stuff. Uh, of course, I'm still gonna have to wait here. Uh, Alliance offer from Sweden. No, thank you, but it does sound interesting. Okay, so Bamberg and Nieder Bayern. Let's see, I don't need those, I think. No, Leipzig, Sax. Well, basically, I need. I'm gonna have to uh, annex uh, Saxony diplomatically. So, diplo annex, and I'm gonna have to take these two. Well, particularly this, but I'm gonna have to take all three of those, unfortunately, from Bran for Brandenburg to be, you know, willing to give in to our demands. Mm, which means I'm gonna have to fabricate another claim on them on for Neumark. It's gonna take a while, I guess. I still don't have that diplomat that I want, have wanted so badly. Of course, it's still there. Uh, in terms of military, wow. We have such good income that it's insane. In terms of trade, our trade is pretty good as well. It's, <laughs> it's actually our best income, the trade. Huh, well, that's, that's interesting, I guess. But right now, I just want to go in and crush them. Well, probably I should have done it differently, though. Yeah, with these guys, I'm gonna attack here. These guys, I'm gonna go there. And I actually should have sent an army to Wittenberg. But that was stupid of me, so. Arrived there on the 5th of July, so let's just go in there. Yep. Armies shall fall. Oh, wow, actually, there's a lot of enemies we have here. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Ottomans are actually the war leader. Huh. Okay. Well, if the Ottomans come, things will get dangerous. For sure, but... Are the Ottomans Western? No, they are not. But they do not have the most epic units and such. So, from that, in that regard, I'm, I'm fine, really. Just need to make sure that I get all this. I don't need to attach to this unit, nor here, nor here. I have this other unit. But yeah, overall, we're, we're doing just fine, really. Do not need any help. Of course, this is going great here, and they are seem to be losing men quite quickly. I think there it's like a problem of attrition or something. That's what I would assume. Which is fine because that means we can have an easier time at doing things, right? And it's gonna take so long for me to take Germany. Like, I have taken it pretty much until the end of the game. I haven't really done too much otherwise. Of course, I should still probably improve my relation with France. That would be helpful. And I need to indeed do this, this, this. Relations improved, yay! Yay, yay, yay. That's good at least. Okay, we've won the Siege of Saxony. That was pretty much expected of us. This one is going to be, yeah. Oh, what? How did they just do that? Oh my god, we lost the 44k stack. For nothing, for nothing. Okay, this means, yeah, we need leaders. That's exactly what it means. Recruit a leader, then go in and crush their armies. 
That's the plan. That's the plan, because they angered us. So we need 24,000 for the Rican infantry. Start making it. So first, let's go away from mines. Let's hire another leader. Oh, this guy's bad. Sildur Minden. Sildur Minden. Leave him of his duties. And then let's get a lot of Frederican infantry. So Hessen, let's make 12. 12 in Nassau. And then four Latin Hussars. Let's make them all here. And then let's mix our Arty. So let's get like four here, four here, four here. And four here, because we can, right? So now, my plan is going to be to do my best to crush the enemy. Like here. Except Marius Aller is not such a strong team. I need to go in here and help him, though. In terms of morale alone, though, we should be able to win, I assume, yes. Although we did take some losses. Poland's a little bit far behind compared to us in technology, but it's all good. And we can improve our technology quite easily. Get the Curaciers as well. Oof, here comes uh, come the Ottomans though. Oh, they do not want to come again though. <laughs> well, that's nice from them, I guess. So, here come our stacks and their units. They have per perished. Perished. I say perished. Okay, Leipzig has been won. <clears throat> so actually this is pretty good, but Those battles were terrible Those battles that we lost, but at the end of the day though, this is gonna go fine Just gonna go fine. I think I have to send Savir Stilsger Salzgitter rather away from here, and I'm sieging Bohemia cuz why the hell not right? I mean I can and I'm getting lots of manpower Every freaking day <laughs> of course. Whoa. Well, we arrived here first, so good luck trying to kill us. What? Okay, well, that was not easy at all. We actually lost so many troops. We have better better stats in everywhere except shock. And we still took so many casualties. We barely took less than them. What does... Wait, what do these guys actually have? The Bohemians. 27? They still beat us so badly. Well, they didn't beat us, but it was pretty even, which we don't want those traits. They do have a defensive, they do have offensive, and they do have quantity, but they don't have quality. So I do not understand. I do not understand. Yeah, and there are traditions and everything else. Let's see. Infantry combat ability. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, and leader fire. I guess that may have made a difference, but still, I don't think it's should have made that difference. <laughs> anyway, I do want my vassal, but it's gonna take a lot. What if I take like Leipzig and Saxony separately? That's gonna be forty-four percent and tons of uh, aggressive extension. I just want this though, like. I'm gonna be fair. Cannot even go into Hungary though. <laughs> That's alright with me though. Okay, I'm just because I'm just sieging right now. I'm not doing anything else. I'm gonna. Okay, we took Bovmer Barl. We took that one too. So let's just keep going to the next. Let's keep going to the next. These ones will just be reserve units. I will be using when we have nothing else. So yeah, whoa, the camera was doing some weird things, as you could see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought we did, we had enough. Oh, no, do not attach to this unit then. Do not attach to this unit. Yep, just sieging right here with not a lot of troops, actually. Oh, we could get a new advisor. Probably that's why we were getting so much money. Inflation, no problem with inflation either. Let's go for the prestige then. This age is always nice. Let's go for this technology. But anyway, that's enough for now, guys. And also, if you enjoyed, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Share the video, and I shall see you next time.